this video, let's take a brief look at the Customize UI feature in 3D Code. Now, you may find that as the feature set continues to grow, that this tool panel becomes increasingly crowded to the point where some of the tools that you're accustomed to working with are obscured and a bit out of reach. Now, I find myself having to continuously collapse sections just to be able to reach certain tools. One option is to hit the space bar, and this is quite handy, much like the hotbox in Maya or the quad menus in 3D Studio Max. However, even still, the more text you have, the more it's like trying to find a single word in a big paragraph. It can be very problematic after a while. So, to remedy that problem, you have Customize UI. And this will allow me to temporarily hide tools that I don't normally work with. And it may be different for you, but some of these tools I've either never used or don't intend to use anytime soon. And now I can quickly switch to volume mode and do the same. Base relief don't use that. I've never used toothpaste. Text, I rarely, rarely ever use that. And so what I did is I created a hotkey for this by hitting the end key. That's E-N-D. Or hit the escape key to get out of that. So again, you can quickly get to it at any point in time without having to go up here into the menu. Okay, by hitting the U key. Now you can see I've got some more real estate and it's not as big a strain on my eyes to locate tools that I'm accustomed to working with. If I hit the U key, I can do the same thing in the retopple room, UV room, sculpt room, etc. etc. I can also, with any of these drop down menus, remove some of these as well as even folders if I need. So I'm going to hit the U key again. No matter if I'm in box of volume mode or surface mode, the result is much, much cleaner. That's even if I hit the space bar to bring up the pop-up tool panel. So I hope this was helpful, and thank you for watching.